in today's video we're going to use these photo album pages and we are going to start our trifold wallet and after that we have a lucky winner from several weeks ago stay tuned hi everybody it's Julie um, I did add a couple more things I added some pages from a photo album and some packaging from paper and what I thought we'd do today is um, see about taking this apart taking this paper out one way of using this. Okay, and being able to make this into Okay, so there's one. And here's one with the pocket still in it. So I'm thinking that we can go ahead and fold this. Yes, I'm still on the gray. Um Old winter is still underneath there. Okay, so I'm going to fold both pieces towards the inside. There's just so many things that we'll be able to use this for, but I loved the, um, the gingham. So, okay. Okay, so um, I haven't, I was going to do pages today and show you, but I haven't decided on my book for sure. We're still on vacation. Tom is still home, so um, I it just, I haven't been able to, to get that thought. <laughs> And that happens sometimes. Sometimes I just go ahead and start making things. Okay, and I know this will fit in either either one. Okay, so there we have that. Okay, and then we can also do it where we go ahead and keep this. When I'm going to do that, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to fold this on right at the fold okay so the little slot is going to be there and I'm going to do the same thing this way fold it right up to the fold and the reason I do that do it that way is then it gives me a big enough space here that I can put that in so now we have a place that we can put things into these pockets. So two different things that we can do with this. Um, and I'm, I mean, I know that there's several more, but we're gonna go ahead and use, let's see, what do we have? This way. I think we'll go ahead and pull out our cool little paper here. So, this was packaging that came, something I bought, I came home and it was wrapped in this. You see it's all wrinkly. Find the closest cow. Okay. I want I want the cow. Okay, so I want cow and then hearts. Yeah, we'll go with cow and hearts.
So I cut a piece off. Go ahead and put down a pocket right here. So this is the beginning of the trifold wallet style with the inserts. Um, I am not going to have enough time to to finish it, but we'll get it get it started. If you're here at the premiere, I'm waving hi and say hello to Lucy. Hi, Lucy. I'm so glad you've joined us today. If this is your first Dear Julie Julie premiere, just know it's a pre recorded video, but we do have a live chat. You can join us in that live chat by hitting that live chat button right down there. Uh, come on in, uh, introduce yourself so that we can welcome you. We also have our Scrap All About It with Dear Julie Julie Facebook group. We'd love to have you join us there. You can share your projects there. And don't forget, there is a free digital in the file section waiting for you while we are home, safer at home. So let's get back to our program. Okay, and then from I'll probably do like a stack of note here. <clears throat> and now remember you can use any of your tools. that we've been using. We have a pile of messy string. the cover. Down the dryer sheet. Tissue. Our cow 
from the packaging. Okay, and that's going to give us the cover and a pocket. And that is the beginning of that. So, um, Next, we're going to move right into the drawing for the way back, many, many weeks ago, the um, paper pads. Guessing how many 12 by 12 paper pads were in the closet. And so that's going to play right here. Okay, so here we have, well, here we have one, two, three, four. Those are the, the really thin scrapbook paper. And then down here, there was 19 in this box. We're counting the ones that are mostly full. And so now I'm gonna move on to this right here. And including the one on top here, we have 50. Okay, so we're gonna move on down here. I'll count those. And in there we had a 62. And this all started because my granddaughter wants a journal that is stars and moons and stuff like that. So I'm looking for my, <laughs> I'm looking for the paper pad that I have. So next we'll count down here. Okay, we have six um, actual paper pads in there. The rest is all singles or packages of paper um this is where like the cork and the lace paper and that kind of thing they so are i have this random stack here um i so we'll count that one next and find it a place okay. to live there was 15 um <laughs> uh, yeah i don't even remember some of them but there were three more of or four more of the thin paper that goes up next to the big pink boxes. Um, I'm really glad to find those. I don't know, I don't know how this, well, I do know how, the, everything's so disorganized. My word for 2021 is order. And I guess we're gonna start with these 12 by 12 pads. So I'm gonna look around, see if there's any more hanging around and we'll tally this up. Okay, I found seven more that were in with Christmas and fall. And I did take out some that I could use for every day. And the others will be going <laughs> to the warehouse. So today we're just counting paper pads that are in here. They're all the ev everyday paper pads. <laughs> so there you go, 12 by 12 paper pads. So we have 163 12 by 12 paper pads here in the craft room. So I'm going to go see if I can find that video and we will see who was closest without going over and that's going to be fun. Okay, so I really struggled finding the post I found it and we have a tie Samantha Bonds and Cheryl Cox both guessed 162 our total was 163 and you just have to be the closest one without going over so Samantha Bonds and Cheryl Cox um, please message me by January 10th so I can get your information to send you off something special and thank you everyone for playing and uh yeah so we can get into the closet now <laughs> i have a uh, 163 12 by 12 paper pads that i need to use up congratulations samantha and cheryl everybody else thank you for playing so congratulations again to samantha and cheryl and I hope you all have a fantastic day. We'll be back to regular scheduling tomorrow. And I will finish this. And don't forget to ask your questions in the comments down below. The description 
box has the link to the details video for this challenge and we'd love to have you join us. Have an amazing day. Find something to celebrate every day. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye.